What's going on guys? Tiger here with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dragon Ball Legends video for you guys. Uh, don't worry, I haven't forgotten about Dokkan. In fact, I'm really, really excited for UI Goku and Jiren to drop on Global tomorrow. And I definitely will come out with a summoning video for you guys the day that it drops, which, like I said, is tomorrow. But I'll be honest, I've been having so much freaking fun with Dragon Ball Legends and I just want to bring more content for you guys. It's still very new, very early in the stages and you know, there's definitely, I think it's lacking in content a little bit, but I definitely see the potential of the game as well moving on into the future. So uh, I'm very excited to have this be a mainstay on my channel and bring you guys more videos about it. So today, the plan is very simple. We're gonna do some summons. Well, I'll probably do one multi summon and then we're just gonna jump into some PvP uh, matches as well and just see how things go. Okay, so without further ado, let's do our multi. So here we go. We're gonna do a multi. Yes. Alright. So I really love all the different animations they have in this game. And um, what is going on over here? <laughs> so it's taking really, really freaking long to load. Um, it's still loading, but it's at 32, 33%, almost two minutes into the <laughs> into the multi. Um, this is crazy. This guy. Oh, it jumped a little bit. Are you freaking serious? Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, 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 okay. It's fully loaded now. I think. Yes. Okay, we got two pods. Fine. That was crazy. Um, he doesn't go super saiyan, which doesn't necessarily mean that we're not gonna get a sparking, but it. It's not the best sign, I guess. Okay, so we got a regular pull. I'm gonna pull down flick. There we go. Can we win this clash? It's gonna be a tie. Okay, so what are we gonna get? It's a extreme. Oh, whoa! Oh, okay! <laughs> oh, damn! Okay! Got Sparking Piccolo. That's crazy! Got a Tien. We're gonna get an extreme again. Uh, Nappa. Alright. Uh, Nappa's really good. I love that guy. Um, we got a Mercenary Tau. Cool. Burner. Chiaotzu. Extreme, Extreme Raditz. He's a solid unit as well. Uh, we're gonna get a Jocko. <laughs> Hero Jocko. We're gonna get a Hero Krillin. And I think this is the last one, Jace. Okay. Damn, guys. Okay, so that's actually the third Piccolo I've pulled. So that's gonna be a four star Piccolo right there. Holy crap. Um. Nice, yeah, my, our Piccolo is a beast, guys. And Piccolo, at least in my opinion, I think he's one of the best units in the entire game right now. And I don't care what anyone says, he is amazing tank. He uh, is a healer, and he still does decent damage as well. So besides the fact that he is just a really, really good defensive unit, um, he just, you know, is able to dole out some damage as well. So he's just a really, really useful unit. Probably the most versatile of all the sparking units out right now. Um, and that was crazy, man. Like the thing where like it tricked me to think it was extreme. It showed me the extreme animation, and then it turned into a sparking thing. Oh, that's crazy, guys. That's awesome. So, we got our four-star Piccolo. We got some uh, other extreme units. So that's a really solid multi. Why don't we do some PvP now? <laughs> yeah. So I lied. I want to do one more multi because that last multi was just way too fire. So we're gonna do another multi here before we jump into PvP. Let's do it. Here we go, consecutive summon, yes. Go away, Jeet, we don't need to talk to you right now. <laughs> and let's see what happens here. Uh, it's taking a while to load, so, whoa, whoa! Whoa, you guys see that? That was, the, that was seven Dragon Balls, flying up into the air, spreading, it's like we just made a wish. Holy crap, okay, let's pull down, flick. Um, he also turned Super Saiyan. We're gonna win this Beam Clash for sure. We're gonna win this. Yes, we, there you go. We won this Beam Clash. Guys, that was the first time I've ever seen that animation. We got a Hero, Tien. It's gotta be a Sparking in here. It's gotta be a Sparking in here. Dodoria. Oh, okay. There's the Sparking. We got a Pan. Okay. Already had a Pan, but that's okay. Krillin. Another one. A Goku. Okay. Nappa. Frieza, what, what is this, what is this? Another Nappa, awesome. So that's a three star Nappa right there. Got Extreme Tien. Got a Hero Goldo. Oh my God, okay. Um, guys, I have never seen that animation before. I've never seen anyone else get that Dragon Balls, like seven Dragon Balls animation as well. 
Um, I know that the Spirit Bomb animation is really rare and is a guaranteed two sparking multi. Our Pan's gonna go three star here. Super sick. Awesome. Uh, guys, I think Pan is super underrated, by the way. Like, I don't care what anybody says. Pan is a really, really good unit. And it's mainly because of her ability to uh, restore her key really fast while causing the enemy to restore the key slower with her uh, main ability. So, yo, so many three star, three star limit breaks here. That's dope. Um, but yeah, uh, Pan is awesome. Goku obviously is great. He's not as good as I think PyCon or Vegeta, at least in my opinion, but uh, I don't have either of those guys. Um, but damn guys, that freaking Dragon Ball 7 Dragon Ball animation was freaking amazing. Let me know if you guys have seen that or gotten that yourselves, because that was the first time I've seen it personally, and that was super hype. So I am really excited to jump into jump into some multis now. Um, yeah, I mean not, not even multis, ah, I'm so excited. Uh, let's to jump into some PvP. So let's get that going. Let's get started. I am so, so hyped. Hope you guys are excited as well. Let's do this. All right, so I hope you guys are hyped for some PvP action right here. Uh, this is the team we're gonna be rocking. We got our four star Sparking Piccolo, three star Sparking uh, SSJ Goku, and three star Sparking Pen. We're gonna also bring a Extreme Nappa for a bit of a boost to uh, yellow. Well, basically we're gonna, he increases, oh, let me just show you, let me just show you. He increases damage dealt to yellow units, which would be mainly PyCon. That's mainly what we're using him for. If people are running PyCon, then this guy will allow us to do a little bit more damage against him. And PyCon is pretty, pretty common in PvP, at least around these ranks as well. I mean, especially around these ranks. And then we're gonna bring the Shallot, or Shallow? I don't know how to say his name. I think it's Shallot. Um, is the ability increases Saiyan's max base health by 10% and that really only buffs uh, our SJ Goku but that's good enough for me and then we're also going to bring this EX Goku because he buffs Goku SJ Goku's base attack strike attack at least by 17% so uh, a lot of buffing for Goku going on here he's going to be our primary damage dealer anyway so we do want him to be as strong as possible but this is the team I am a little bit nervous because uh, I actually breezed through the ranks pretty quickly, getting up to 38, but then at this point, the last couple matches I've been doing, uh, I've been struggling a little bit. People are getting really good around this time, and also people are getting having really strong teams, and I'm having trouble with Vegeta. Like, Vegeta is probably the best unit in the game right now, and people that have him are giving me a pain in the ass, but you know what? Um, I think I'm okay at this game. I know some of you out there are probably a lot better than me, so... I'm gonna do, let's say, three matches, and then if you guys see anything wrong with the way I'm playing, have any tips for me, definitely leave them in the comments. I will read them, I will respond to them, and I really appreciate you guys helping me get better at this game. And uh, let's just help each other out. If you guys have questions or anything like that, then ask me as well, and I'll try my best to answer them. But without further ado, let's jump into some PvP matches. I'm gonna go raiding match. Uh, here's, the, here's the thing, so if we get a um, bot, like an AI bot, that has like level 600 to 800 um, level characters and then we're not gonna fight them, okay? Because I can beat them once in a while, but it's no fun fighting against characters that are twice as strong as yours. So here we got a actual player, okay, we got Preet. He is rank 31, his team seems decent. Yeah, he has a SP Vegeta, um, EX Goku, SP, uh, SSJ Goku as well. So this could be a bit of a tough fight. We're gonna go like that, yeah. And uh, I'm gonna focus a little bit so I might not be talking as much, but let's 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 hope we do some nice things. Let's let's hope we crush Preet's ass. But if not, it'll be a learning experience, and you guys can tell me what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> so what I like to do in the beginning of matches is open up by trying to bait out their dodge. So then I'll, I'll usually just throw like one key blast and see if I can get their dodge out, and then they'll come attack me, and then I'll dodge that, and then just wail out of them. So, okay, here we go. He is gonna go Frieza first. Interesting, okay. Oh, oh, let's dodge that. Oh, okay, so he actually didn't dodge after we dodged, so that's good. We're just gonna, we're just gonna use all of our things on him, and I'm gonna try to charge up some key here. And he's gonna, you know, do some things. We're gonna switch to Piccolo, so we can tank this damage. Here we go. And he's gonna switch to SJ Goku, that's okay. Here we go. And this guy is not dodging. Okay, that's interesting. So I usually um, usually expect him to dodge immediately after I dodge, but this guy's not, so I'm just gonna punish him for that. 
Here we go. We're gonna switch to Pan so that we don't. Oh, here we go. Oh, boom. Uh, he's gonna dodge that. Okay. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Okay. Let's switch to Goku because Goku can tank a little bit better, I think, than Pan. I'm not 100% sure. But we also get our full dodge. Um, here we go. Oh, oh, oh! I tried to dodge that. That's weird. Okay. Um, can we? Can we dodge this? Can we dodge this? Come on! Come on! Come on! Fuck. Okay. Um. Oh, I can I just actually just, actually just pressed that by accident. I usually would go with the strike. Yeah. Damn it. Okay, I would usually go with the strike card because that's what usually people pick because they try to throw you off. But they're like, oh, that's the obvious one, so I'm gonna choose that. So like, you don't think I'm gonna get that? Choose that. But anyways, um, it's it's fine. It's fine. Whatever. So yeah, like, like I said, like Vegeta, uh, we're, we're striking a little bit against Vegeta because he just hits so damn hard, guys. Um, let's see if we can get this rising rush on him. Let's see if we can get this rising rush off on him. I think he uses dodge, right? He uses dodge, so I don't. Th yeah. Okay. There we go. Uh, let's go with key blast card. Yeah, I was right in a, in. A, I was right that he already used his dodge, so we should be okay. And we got the success. So even though we have type disadvantage, I think this Vegeta is still dead. He's dead. Yeah. There we go. Okay, um, now we have to deal with his Frieza, but I'm not too concerned about the Frieza. We're just gonna tank everything with with uh, Piccolo. There we go, and we're gonna wail out on Frieza. We're gonna go charge up on him now and punch him in the face a couple times. And then we're gonna use another... Yep, he's dead, okay. We got this fight in the bag. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Pan. Switch to Pan, I'm gonna dodge that, boom. And then we're gonna use her main ability to reduce his, or uh, slow down his key restore. And he can, you know, do whatever he wants, but we're gonna... Yep, there we go. So that is the match, guys. It was looking a little shaky there for a second, but we got this guy. We beat his ass. Um, and we are almost ranked 39, so we're gonna do two more PvP matches. I'm probably gonna lose one of them. I'm just being real. Like, the competition around, the, around these ranks is fairly tough, but our team is pretty nice, and I think... I'm I think your boy is still decent at this game, so we got a pretty good chance. And now this team is uh, this is gonna be pretty tough. He's got the Piccolo, he's got the Pycon, and he's also got the Vegeta. I'm gonna assume that he's gonna go Vegeta first. So let's go with the. I mean, either way, either way, if he goes Vegeta first or Pycon first, Goku is gonna be the best choice, I think, because um, you know we don't have the type of disadvantage. So the way I usually go with these matches is yeah, I try to bait out their dodge. And then we dodge their attack, and then we just bail out. And then obviously we try to match types as best as possible. We always try to have the type advantage in the matchups um, whenever possible. Whenever possible. I mean, you know, sometimes I do freak out. I'm like, okay, here we got the Goku, so I'm gonna switch immediately to to Piccolo. And yeah, we got the type advantage here, so I'm gonna do a ton of damage. But then he's gonna switch to Vegeta, of course. So we're gonna switch to Pan um, after we do this. I'm gonna. Here we go, boom, boom, boom. These guys are not are not dodging any of my attacks. This is really strange. Okay, uh, I'm gonna switch to Goku now. Let's charge up the key. This guy doesn't dodge. How did he get this high in rank without dodging? This is so strange. Okay, we're gonna switch to Piccolo now and uh, bait out his dodge, and then we're gonna dodge. There we go. There we go. Come on. Yes, okay, dead. I'm gonna switch to Pan. Oh, I switched, I switched to Pan. Um, that was a bad call. I'm gonna switch to Goku now. Why is it not switching? Why is he not switching? <laughs> there we go. Okay, there we go. Okay. Okay, let's try to bait out his dodge and then get a, uh, get a rising rush on him. Rising rush. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh, okay. Oh, uh oh, we're gonna both gonna. Oh, okay, crap, okay, okay, let's go, let's go for the strike. Cause, like I said, most people go for the strike cause they try to throw you off. But, okay, well, <laughs> not this guy apparently. Um, this is gonna be bad. This, this is gonna be bad. Uh, are we dead? We are not dead. Okay, let's switch to Piccolo or switch to Pan real quick. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna do a clash. Focus, focus, 937, 948, damn it, damn it. That was a pretty decent one, actually. But no, he, he got us on that one, he got us on that one. Um, mm, okay, this is gonna be a close one. Do not dodge it, please. Okay, now we're gonna go for, yeah, we're gonna go for the super. 
if this lands, if this is a success, then he's dead. He's dead. Okay. So we still got the Piccolo. Yes, we still got the Piccolo and the Vegeta and, and the Goku. I think. I think the Goku. Yeah. Okay. So, so we can dodge this one. And oh, I think he's dead. He's he's, he's freaking dead. Okay. 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 Yes. 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 Guys. Yes. Okay. Come on. Finish him off. Oh, oh shoot, oh, he's still alive, he's still alive. Come on. No! <gasps> no, I should have dodged first, I should have dodged. Oh, that was painful. That was painful, I gotta redeem myself now. Oh my god, that was terrible, guys. I'm, I'm sorry, that was, ah. Uh, I hate, I hate, ah. Uh. No, I, I, I know the mistake I made, I should have dodged. Or... No, no, that's what I should have done. I should have dodged and then attacked, but I just freaked out a little bit. Um, so, we're gonna redeem ourselves with this next fight. If this guy doesn't disconnect, that is. Sometimes when there's a big difference in the teams, these people will just straight up disconnect. There you go, connection with opponent lost. Yeah. Um, but, damn, yeah, I know exactly the mistake I made there. And this guy straight up doesn't dodge anyway, so if I dodged, if I slipped his attack, and then just went in. He would have been done. He would have been done. Oh, man, that 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 sucks. Um, so yeah, we have one win, one loss. Let's try to leave this video with a winning record of two to one. This team does look decent. Like he he doesn't. He definitely has the hard hitters, Pycon and Vegeta, and also the Pan, of course. So um, a little bit, a little cause for concern. But you know, I think. I, oh, are you serious? This guy, this guy disconnected too, that's weird. Because it looked like a pretty even match to me, but I guess he didn't see it that way. Um, yo, it sucks when you have those matches that are so close and you knew, and you know. You just know that you, you could have had that. I'm gonna actually go Piccolo first because I'm sure he's gonna go with the extreme blue Goku. But yeah, it just sucks when you have those close matches and you know you could have won. You know you had that fight. What is happening? Why is everyone disconnecting from me? I'm not that good, guys. I'm serious. Like, I, I have decent characters, but I'm actually not amazing. Like, ugh. Um, yeah, I'm still reeling from, the last, that, from that last match. It, it hurts my soul. It hurts my soul. Um, okay, can we please? Can we please get an actual fight? Just stay, dude. Come on. Okay, if this guy disconnects, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to end the video right here. I'm just going to end the video right here because... Okay, thank you. Thank you, King. Thank you, King. You're awesome. You're, you're, you are the king of this video. Um, but yeah, I'm still reeling from that, that loss. It just, it was so damn close. The good thing is that when you do lose in this game, you don't get punished too much. You only lose a little bit of uh, rank points or battle points or whatever it's called. So it doesn't hurt me too much in the long run. And I, 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 I'm going to redeem myself here with this fight and I'll feel a little bit better. But let me know, like guys, like what, what kind of mistakes I'm making. What do you think I could be doing better? And oh, I should have slipped that. That should have been a slip. Why did I not? Why? Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Piccolo to tank damage, and then uh, go in for the beatdown. Here we go. So Piccolo is almost gonna. Actually, no. If we, if all this lands, if he doesn't switch, he's we're gonna. Yep, dead. Okay, good. Gonna charge up some key. I think we have a full dodge meter too, so we should be okay in that department. Here we go. You're dead. You're you are dead. Boom! Oh, that blue piccolo is almost dead. Here we go. That's gonna do like no damage to us because we're awesome. <laughs> At least piccolo is awesome. And okay, just just do whatever you want, dude. You're gonna, not gonna do much damage to me anyways. I'm gonna charge up some key. Let him charge up whatever. Okay, slip that, slip that, slip that. We're gonna slip this, and he's dead. <laughs> okay, and uh, we're gonna switch to Pan. Add salt to the wound. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna kill his Goku with Pan, just to make it that much more painful. And we're gonna also use our main ability. Here we go. Oh yeah, you think that's gonna hit? We're gonna switch to Goku. Keep, keep, keep slipping, keep slipping. Goodbye. 
<laughs> Goodbye. That is game, set, and match. So that's usually how I win most of my matches. A lot of people, a lot of people these days, um, just keep, keep trying to slip and then go in for the attack. But the main thing to keep in mind is that your opponent also has their dodge active as well. So you have to try to bait out your the opponent's dodge first, and then you dodge, and then they can't dodge anymore, and that's when you go in. So there you go, guys. That is the video for today. Some hype summons as well as some uh, mixed PvP matches. But nonetheless, this game is freaking fun. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if you guys have any tips for me, let me know. I know that I have a lot of improvements to do before I can call myself good at this game. I'm trying to get good, so give me some tips down below. If you guys like the video, make sure to like the damn video. If you're brand new to my channel, first time seeing me, uh, like what you see. Consider going down to that big red subscribe button, hitting that button to join the Tiger Squad now. As always, I hope you guys have a fantastic day. This is Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.